I'm Rachel Carroll, director of the Carroll Home Team, uh, realtors here serving the space in Treasure Coast. And today I wanted to feature one of my favorite local businesses. I'm here with Stephanie, one of the owners of Downtown Dipper Ice Cream Shop here in downtown Vero Beach, Florida. And um, I just want to ask you a couple of questions sure. that help people like, better acquaint themselves with your business. Absolutely. So you've been open since around November. Was it November? Uh, yep, so our first night was actually Black Friday. Okay, Black Friday. So November 2023, you've been open. I frequent here with my family. I know a lot of um, other local families do too, children without children. Uh, there's, It's a great space inside. There's seating. It's For us, one of the reasons I like to come here is because you all are a family. You have children. It's like a very relaxed, laid back ice cream shop vibe. Hi. <laughs> and um, it's just really inviting when we come in. And I guess the first thing I want to ask is um, if somebody's going to come visit your ice cream shop, what can they expect? It's like when they first walk in the door. Yeah, so definitely um, the first thing you're going to get is a reading, eye contact, like our best. Our top thing is customer service. So we want to make the customer feel welcome and like you said, invited and you know, just happy to be here. Yeah, I feel that. I mean, I can do it. That's what I'm going for. <laughs> awesome. Um, and when they come in, what kind of ice cream are you serving? Because I know people, when it comes to ice cream shops, there are a few options in town. And why would somebody want to come here versus elsewhere? I could tell you why. Yeah. So, well, if you're local, you um, know of Boardwalk Ice Cream. And so we are lucky and so excited to be able to serve the same ice cream that they had, which is Ice Cream Club ice cream. Okay. Um, so we brought it back to Vero. Super excited about it. Cool. It's really good. It is really good. <laughs> I really like the um, cookie uh, ice cream sandwich. Oh, yeah. Brought yeah. well, that in. Yep. We have yes. um, cookies that are actually made from a local girl here in Vero. Okay. Um, uh, her name is Roxanne Gibbons. And she I know Roxanne. Yeah, so she makes all yeah. her cookies. She, she brings them every day. Okay. Yeah. yeah she's, so she's diving back into the business and she actually came here um, with a party that we, that we did. She, uh, she made the cake for the party that day um, and so I linked up with her and now she delivers cookies every Wednesday and well, they sell out so they're it, fresh yes you need to come I, in on Wednesday I can't believe that like I believe in yeah yeah okay yeah. I love her awesome that's good I'm glad I asked yeah it. she is awesome okay cool so you have to tell me is it fun working in an ice cream shop well do you think it'd be fun to work in an ice cream shop <laughs> yeah it's awesome I mean no, it's fun. It is. We have a good group um, here with us. We have uh, my girls actually work here, so that's fun to be close with them on the weekends. Yeah. Um, and then we have um, four or five kids that also work with us. Um, they go to the Flynn and the high school, so okay. we keep it small. We keep it. We keep it close, and that's uh, nice. We have fun. Yeah, that's nice. Cool. Yeah, I would always think it would be fun. Uh, my biggest problem would be just eating my ice cream. We could that too. Yeah. yeah, and you get strong on one side. Yeah, okay. So you get that, yeah, that's okay. right. You have a scoop. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. So, what was the inspiration behind this business? Because I know your husband has um, downtown Dapper right across the street. Yep. What was the inspiration behind the ice cream? So, he, he's he been down here for almost 10 years. Um, so, we've been down here. Uh, we're, we're always downtown. We eat at the restaurants downtown. We go to the park downtown. Um, so honestly, one day when I was walking the kids back down from the park, I had nowhere to go like for ice cream or for a drink or eat, like a snack. Yeah. And so, um, and if I was putting my kids back in the car, we were going home. We weren't going to stop anywhere. So yeah. like once you like, get them, yeah, it's, done. It's, done. it's done. So honestly, after Joey was like, you know, I think we should try to open something else. Let's open something else. And I was like, we really need an ice cream shop now. I feel like everywhere we go, you know, downtown Stewart, downtown Melbourne, you know, even downtown Fort Pierce, everybody has some type of ice cream and we don't. And so I just, we waited for the right spot to open up and we um, looked at a couple places, uh, like a storefronts downtown. And then when this one came up, it was about a year and a half, but we waited and then this one came up and we thought, let's try it. It's the perfect spot, honestly, because you're right. It's got Pocahontas Park right down the street. I would take my kids into the coffee shop. I love that coffee shop. I mean, I spent so oh, yeah. much money there. But it's not like, it is super family friendly, but it's not like a kid's snack kind of yeah, place, right? right? And this is perfect. Even if you're just passing through downtown. Yeah. So I love it. So 
you have to tell me what is your favorite flavor of ice cream? So I do cookie dough everywhere I go. But I did um, venture out. We had a raspberry truffle. And that's one of my tops. Okay. Right yeah. I, I think I just fed that to one of my kids. Yes, yeah, it's okay. so good. I love that one too. Okay, I think we've got a lot of good ones. You know, there's, uh, they love the coconut. There's coconut, all, uh, toasted coconut, and the coconut almond fudge. Tastes like the almond joy That's candy cool. bar. That sounds really good. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, I guess the nice thing about it is that you get to try them. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. just get to feel yeah. like yeah. it. Just <laughs> toss them and get a new one. Right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's nice. Awesome, Stephanie. So thank you. I really appreciate the opportunity to feature your local business here. And again, it's one that my family is a fan of. Uh, I really love the fact that you're, you have a family of your own. You all are local. You own another business right here in downtown Vero Beach. I think it's really cool what you're doing. Um, is there anything else that you want to share about the ice cream shop with the Vero Beach community or anybody who's looking or reaches this video. So yeah, no, I'm always open to, uh, you know, advice or changes or things that you did or didn't like. Um, I love to hear, I love feedback, you know, on whatever side it's on. So um, I'm open to that. I love making changes if there needs to be, um, adjusting. Um, we're very new right now. So I feel like we're in that time where we can be flexible and, you know, take the feedback from everyone and whoever you know, we're open to it. Cool. And then uh, one last thing, it's like, how about events? Because right now we're in the middle of doing uh, our own client appreciation event here. Yeah. Our clients come in, get them and their family a uh, scoop of ice cream on us. Um, have you hosted any other events? Is that something that you want to look into going forward? It's yeah, no, I love, I love the idea. Um, we do host, host uh, birthday parties. Okay. Um, so we started with parties, um, but we've also had people reach out, you know, about bridal showers and brunches and things like that. So yeah, yeah I would be, you know, I'm totally up and kind of in the works with some things there. So yeah, and again, I can bounce around any ideas, anything. So if we can fit in here, if we can incorporate ice cream, we're in. You're in. Awesome. Well, thank you very you much. Want. Thank you. Yeah. All right, guys, so if you want to come get yourself a scoop of ice cream here at Downtown Dipper in Mason Vero Beach, we are at 2036 14th Avenue in Vero Beach, Florida. What are your hours? What are your days and times? So we are open Tuesday through Saturday um, from 1 o'clock to 9 o'clock and then until 10 o'clock on Friday, Saturday. Okay, so we hope to see you here.